The evacuation is underway along the Texas Gulf Coast. Hundreds of thousands have been ordered to flee a menacing Hurricane Ike. One of them was this sick girl. Tech Sergeant Steve German has this update from San Antonio, Texas. A critical care transport team from Wilford Hall Medical Center traveled to Driscoll Children's Hospital in Corpus Christi to bring back eight-day-old Alana Garcia. Alana was having some problems breathing, and she was put onto an extracorporeal membrane oxygenation, or what's called an ECMO machine. And Wilford Hall Medical Center is the only military hospital that can perform long-distance transports of this nature. Alana is now being treated here at Wilford Hall Medical Center. Reporting for the Pentagon Channel, Tech Sergeant Steve German, San Antonio, Texas. In preparation for Hurricane Ike, the Texas Air National Guard evacuated a number of special needs patients from the Corpus Christi area. Other Army, Navy, and Coast Guard units are moving the place to provide air evacuation if needed or to deliver relief supplies. Hurricane Ike is expected to make landfall early Saturday morning along the Texas coast between Corpus Christi and Port Charles, possibly the Category 4 storm. Keeping you informed, military news throughout the day on the Pentagon Channel. I'm Petty Officer Andrew Holloway.